Okay, uh, today I want to show you another trick. I have the the same code B zero zero two one B zero zero twenty two. It's a it's another truck I have now. And but this truck is no shaking or anything like the other one. Drives very smooth, but still showing the coat. So. Uh, I just want to tell you something I forgot to say in my last video. Uh, if you drive the truck and and when you stop at the traffic and then you see your truck or you feel your truck is shaking, losing power and you have to turn it off and start it again. So that's mean your VCT valve is going bad and to know this the trick is you open your hood you start your engine and then disconnect one of the coil plug and if the if this side like see the driver side if you disconnect one of the, the ignition coil plug and if it's uh, if it's shaking, so that's mean this side is working fine. If it's not shaking, it does mean your VCT valve is bad. That's how I I do mine. Uh, so the last track when I disconnect one of the side and it's not shaking, I disconnect the other side and start shaking. So I only change it the one with with the side not shaking i change this one here and the car starts fine but this one the the code i change both of um, this car was shaking so bad i change the vct solenoid this side and the other side also i got it from ford the original but the code is still showing without no shaking or anything uh, I did flush the engine. I bought some chemicals in there and make it any like you see now is new was like full of carbon black and dirt stuff. Now it looks like brand new. So you can see this lines over here all over the cam. So I decided to do the same thing with my other truck. I replaced the the whole valve and the rocker arms on both sides and i will tell you the results if this fixing my my issue or no because i feel the timing is good the cam phaser is good like you can see here it's aligned with this arrow okay you cannot see right with the camera but it's aligned with the arrow uh and this is the original phaser so so uh, i left this like uh, i bought this here in oil yesterday i stuck it in oil i leave it for a day uh here is the valve right here the followers like i show you last time the old one was bad and it is stuck it's not releasing any oil so that's what I feel with this truck is no enough oil pressure that's why I'm going to change it you can see even the head over here is gone so get the new one I'm going to uninstall it and I let you know the result if the if the code is gone or no uh thank you for watching please subscribe and like my video if you would thank you so much